girls basketball team for the South Carolina School for the Deaf and Blind held game one of their 11 team tournament today. They're facing off to see who will win the championship title. Athletic director Michael Sims says it's not just about winning for the girls, it's about getting a chance to make new friends. We're hoping for it's for our kids and the other athletes that are traveling from the other states to come in to make new friends, build new relationships, but also have an exciting time here in South Carolina. The school only had a boys tournament in 1978, so Camilla Ramborger decided to start one for the girls. The Tennessee School for the Deaf hosted the Boys Mason Dixon Tournament and I sat and I watched the players and I really, really enjoyed that. I was like, oh my gosh, but, and I had no idea about the girls basketball tournament. They had no idea. So then when I got a job here, I established the Girls Mason Dixon Tournament. The tournament features schools from 11 states south of the Mason Dixon line and it will run until Sunday. So if you want to see who takes home the championship title, the event is free and open to the public. For more information, visit our website at WSBA.com. Reporting in Spartanburg, Kristen Cheatham, 7 News.